Chapter 30 Creating Takeoff Highlighters So far, it was assumed that wide highlighter blue was to represent the area of brick. However, new highlighters can be created to reflect specific materials. This next example shows how to create a new highlighter to specifically calculate the area of brick. Select File, System Options, System Library. The Configure Library menu opens. Select Takeoff as the library type. Previously, a library was created called Softlist Materials. Click on the Softlist Materials library and select the One Step button to add a new highlighter. Type in Brick as the name of the highlighter. In the Configure Takeoff Types menu, select a fill color for brick. Set the height to 9 feet and the thickness to 3.5 inches. SoftPlan will use these defaults when drawing the highlighter. Select OK and then OK again from the Configure Library menu. Edit the wide highlighter blue on the CAD drawing and use the name field to change the highlighter to be the new Softlist Materials Brick Highlighter. The next step is to set the material to calculate the elevation area. Right-click the Takeoff Types definition in the Navigation menu and select Edit Material Definition. Insert a new material under the Wide Highlighters section. Select Takeoff as the material group. When the Material Setup menu opens, enter Brick as the material name. In the Include field, select By Floor. Select Square Feet for the units. Set the Takeoff component to By Edge. Click the Library field. Remove the check from the box next to Link Whole Library and select Softlist Materials from the list. Set the symbol to Brick. Next, set the material to calculate the Elevation underscore Area variable. Lastly, select the Accounting button and assign a sequence number of 1200. Select OK to exit the menus and save the changes when prompted. Regenerate the Takeoff Types report. The material, brick, will be visible and the total calculated square feet will be listed.